So Yoga Singh told my brother, why don't you do the Sahaja Yoga your sister is doing? And my brother said, no, no, she's not doing anymore. And he said, okay, but you should carry on. So he took uh, my brother to Sri Matadi. And that's how my brother started Sahaja Yoga. So they both were running meeting in the Montague Hall in the Hanslow. And one day, he told my brother, due to your sister, I'm in Sahaja Yoga. So when my brother mentioned to me, and I didn't remember that time, and then my brother told me, he's the man who was doing a lot of arguments. I said, yes, 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 I remember. He was constant, and for me, it was very rude to talk to any elders like that. So Sri Mataji did ask me and I give him realization. So that's why uh, Yoga Singh said, I it is I have obligation that I have to take you to your Sahaja Yoga. That's how my brother also started Sahaja Yoga. And uh, now first experience of my vibration was hot. Kelston Hall again and there was a meeting and I was a little late. Sri Mataji was sitting at me. That day we got on the small room because there was a big event was going in big hall. So Mataji was sitting there and there was a few people sitting around her on the floor in round circle. When I went in the hall, Mataji said, come here, put your both hands towards this man. I, I did put my both hands towards that gentleman and in my head, I thought, usually Shri Mataji asked me to put one hand towards her and other hand towards that gentleman. But why she's asking me to put two hands? But no question. We were not allowed to say why you are telling this and no question. So I said, okay, I stood there. And after a while, my head started, got very hot. So I thought something is wrong with me. So I just went in the washroom. I washed my hands. It was winter time. I washed with the cold water and I felt good. I came back in the hall and I stood again with two hands. Within two, three minutes, again my hands is hot. I went again four, five times I went and Shimataji was watching me. So when I put the, and it went really red. And I thought, I don't know why my hand is. So Mataji asked me, what happened? What happened? She asked me in Hindi. I said, Mataji, I don't know why my hand is getting hot. Immediately said, because this is Tantric is sitting here. And now he's going to run and he's not coming back. The gentleman got up and he ran. And the other gentleman was sitting there. And this both gentlemen came from the Indian embassy. They were in good post. So she, other gentlemen started describing Sri Mataji as a Mahakali. And I thought, why this man is t telling Mataji Mahakali? She's Mataji, she's a woman. And Mataji knew what is going in this head. Mataji said, oh, because he's possessed, that tantric has done something on him. So he can see me as a Mahakali and you can see me as an ordinary woman. So that was my first experience of vibration, hot hands. Vibration ka pata chala. Vibration mata ji, bihari naam ye karta hai. Amam haat karo, kone vibration naam hai. Oh, Shri Mata ji used to say, do like this and feel, do you feel any coolness coming in your finger? Um, and she used to ask to hold my feet mm -hmm. and that's how she used to transfer the vibration because chakras were not working. Mm -hmm. So here a mini chakra, if you do this, mm -hmm. might it get activated. And when vibration starts, she said, now take it on Sasa, like this. Oh, take your heart, your hand here and feel it. But, 
सहस्रार पे जैसे एक हजार पेटल्स बोलते हैं पंखुड़ी है वो आप वो स्थिति हम लोग को कुछ डिस्क्राइब करेंगे कुछ बताएंगे जब बात सहस्त्रार खुलता है तो कैसा लगता है पूरा सहस्त्रार खुलता है तो अनुभूति क्या होती है बताइए नहीं पूरा नहीं खुलता कोई नहीं कोई कोई प्रोपान नहीं खुले कोई नहीं कोई पास नहीं खुले ये ये रीते सहस्त्रार पर पढ़े जा रहे हैं ये कुमार तारिया अपने अन्न बुलाम नो फुल ना होए ये ये रीत में पापा कर लियो अपने आए क्यों भी ची अकेले देखा है अने बिजार में उबारा की तो ये ये रात बाद बराबर है ये वाइजेशन बास सेज एवरीबॉडी सासरा डज नॉट ओपन कंपलीटली फ्यू पेटल्स ओपन्स दैट यू कैन सी एंड व्हेन यू क्लोज योर आईज यू कैन सी इट्स लाइक ए रोज पेटल्स Petals of the sasrada you can see, and it's opening, so it opens little, 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 little. Mm -hmm. But when sa complete sasrada opens, you feel your half head is cut yeah. and it's gone. Yes, half head actually. Sometimes you do not feel your top and part I, of your head. And when you close your eyes, you can see the light. Hmm. Like, like many times we are doing meditation and when we reach to fourth stage, literally it's like one thousand voltage bulb is here and the light is coming towards your sasrad. And it's like a magnetic rays. You feel like little magnetic pull hmm. from inside you. It's, and it is cool. It is a light, but it is a cool light. It comes from there, like yeah, this. Yes, Yesterday one girl came and we were doing med meditation, I think day before yesterday she just came and she sat there and she had a nice experience so Savita Didi said do this and she started doing that. Afterwards she said when I did like this, it's like a water is pouring from her one hand to other hand. There is one little girl, she's also doing like this. She said, when I do this, it's a water is pouring from one hand to other hand. In fact, there is no water, but that is the Kundalini energy. And then they used to watch each other, Sasras, how it looks. Close to your eyes and like uh, if uh, I want to see Baz uh, Sasra, I'll put attention, close my eyes, and I can see that here picture. Her limbic area comes here. And so that's how we tune each other. And she says, through vibration, we know in collective whose vibration uh, Sasra is open and not open. And how, but how does Kundalini works from Sushumna when it goes up? How you feel? Kevi rite e tamne feel thai jare Sushumna mati Kundalini upar jai tiare. Yeh apne ek ek chakra upar jota jai ne prachi. Aur ba tam joy chhe na akhe thi koi dios. Pehla me vich rite de ta realization. Pa realization nahi. जाले वो यहाँ बैठी जो अन्न मरी कुंडली नहीं हम ऊपर जाए चे ये तमने केवी देखा ही चे ये जो कपड़ा पहने हुए ने तो ये आई थी आई थी ये मामा जैसे अभी अभी रीते देखा वो छोकरा वाले को शर्ट पहना हुए ने सर बोले यहाँ पे यहाँ मामा मामा मुझे बस एक्सप्लेनिंग इफ समबडी सिटिंग देर एंड दे हैव द क्लोथ through the clothes, you can see something is going up, uh, like a water. Water is running. You make a little path of the water, and the water is running through that. And through that watery flow, you see the chakra is moving inside. It's going round, 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 round. And they were practicing 
and so with small children, even small children used to see that. Ba, you have to do here now. Yes, please. All the side, we get the good children, and that will be really good. Yes. It will be gain for them, but it is also work for them. They will get so excited to watch each other's kundalini, and they will integrate with each other yes. easily. It's the practical way, and once they've experienced it, then there's no other. No other. And then they will learn what is the side you. So, ba, apre karsu, shen, ab, ham karenge aisa. Bacho ko bula ke, unko batayenge kaise kundalini dikhti hai. Yes, ba, agreed that we are going to call the teacher. I don't have any water, I don't have any water. And the big kids? बड़े बच्चों का कुछ ज़्यादा ही बड़े बच्चे आप मोटा नहीं आपने कुंडली नहीं बता दिया तो क्या इतना बता भी सकते How to make them see the कुंडली vibrations देखा है ना बात बता ना देखा था फिर से कलेक्टर में ना बात ऐसे ऐसे एक एक आंशिक मंत्र में ये आभास होता है कभी कभी ये नुक्सान होती है लेकिन एक कलेक्टिव ट्रू प्रैक्टिस यू कैन सी नाउ ओके आई आई डिड नॉट हैव दैट विज़न बट व्हेन बाय इस टू डिस्क्राइब एंड आई वांट टू आई मस्ट सी दिस सो व्हाट लाइक आई एम सिटिंग हियर ओके इफ यू लुक एट मी यू विल लुक मी and your eyes little higher, mm. you will see the white line. And by practice, you will see that white line. When, when if I raise my kundalini mm. more, you will see it, that is rising. If I raise my attention here, you will see that white aura is coming out, and that is your kundalini. Aura is the kundalini because it passes through each chakra and brings the color of that is a rainbow. So by practicing, you can see the vibrations. But we do not have habit. So now I have a habit. I watch everyone whose head, what level is gone, the vibration. It's a fun. अपने ये कोकट कर दे रखूँ तो क्यों नहीं अच्छा अब कहीं ना उगे वन ये ये तो क्योरिंग ना जाए ना बाहर दवा मार जाए पर अपने साहस योग मां चक्र चे नाड़ी चे ऐनी पक क्यों भी रहते काम करो ऐना ऐनी अनुभूति आ क्यों भी ऐना बाते अन्य सास्त्रार में सो अनुभूति सास्त्रार खुलवाती सो लाभ थाई by opening सास्त्रार what we are benefited we understand chakras and everything is, but why sahasrara is, we have to open? What is the reason if sahasrara opens, we are, we, we, what we are going to benefit? Oh, we are connected then. We are connected, but there are many other things. Parmeshwari Shakti said, Eka Karita. Till the time Sahasrara is going to open, then it's not. But sometimes little Sahasrara opens, we touch that point, we come back. But we are not benefited much. Very little experience it comes and we get satisfied with that. So here Shri Mataji said, get little greedy. She has permitted us at this level, get little greedy and practice that. And also when you reach this point, before raise your attention higher, ask Sri Mataji, give me complete side yoga. I ask her daily, Sri Mataji, give me complete side yoga, complete knowledge of the side yoga. So if I give, give the, if I transfer this knowledge to any soul, I give them completeness. I do not give them half knowledge. If I'm half baked cookies, I will create another half baked cookies. So that is not a work of side yoga. So now we always meditate, and we must ask this to Mataji: Give me completeness. While asking this, 
She will start opening your sastra. So here she asked for our desire. Yes, okay, Kundalini fine. Vibration fine. But sastra we have to ask again for completeness. And little bit work out. And collective conscious will, uh, will be like a more voltage. It is a, this is magnet, electronic magnetic power. Well, if your body get generated more, you sometimes touching something, you get shocked. Because the power is more. So, again, adding more power of the Param Chaitanya, it comes double. So, at that time, we have to make sure we are sitting in a nice place and our body is not touching each other. Why, I'll tell you. When you are touching, your body is touching each other, you are meditating fine. But next body is not meditating. They are not in that level. They take your current in their body. And they get comfort. Other body is taking. And you, your attention is not rising. And according to, you put 100% effort. But you do, you are not benefited that. So please take your space, part, and then do the collective meditation. Then you will benefit it more. Then your aura has to, space to come out. Otherwise, even aura, uh, I have noticed many people, they sit to next to each other. And the last person, the aura had come out from one side and one side is not come out. It's like somebody has done sandwich. So again, at that year, left or right, whatever side is there, you are not benefiting. And might, you will feel hot that hand and not flowing energy. So we need to do that. Lot of things, small, small things are there. We have to be alert about that things. Or sometimes some other bodies, currents are different currents. It will penetrate our system. It's so Sarara is open. Uh, I told once, long time ago, Sri Mataji, why don't you give us vision? So we can see everything and we can work it out. And she said, what, are you mad? Do you know, there's nothing is a glorifying things you can see. There's a horror there. Horrible, horrible things are there. If you see those things, you'll get frightened. I asked her because that man was describing Mahakali. So I thought, might I will see something. <laughs> Sri Mataji said that. that. And she said, it's a horrible things are that. You will frighten and then you will be never ever you be able to practice Sahaja Yoga. No, no, vision is not good. I am not going to give vision. Work it out through your sastra and everything will be worked out. So that's why she has... Otherwise, once your Kundalini is passing through here, your vision can be open. But certain things she has not disclosed to us. Yeah, to our system, yes. But not fully awareness. Just, the more yeah. we practice, that awareness will tap into it. So, like the, the pen drive. Maybe there is pen drive system in this system. In future, we'll get the pen drive insert and that will reveal. Did she did she tell techniques to nourish the Sahasrara as such? Because at that point when Shimatsuri was telling so many things and there were seekers, the Kundalini would be up and there were cases where she would tie the Kundalini up like one yogini she tied it for six months up there. And to stop it coming down, did she tell techniques to people that you would, could share possibly? Ba Mataji ne koi aisi technique pata hi hai ki kundalini aap yahan baan sakte hain completely to fir wo niche nahi aayegi. Ye to Mataji hum upar aa jaye to itna banda hota hai. Yeah, Shri Mataji used to do that but I don't think so she has revealed that. 
पर और कोई तरीके से जैसे ससुराल को और नरिश कर सके वो जैसे एक तेल लगा के रखना है ससुराल पे उससे है ना इस तरीके से सॉफ्टेन on our pitas, which is the root of the chakras. Here is the root. This is upside down tree. Yeah. And when we kundalini comes up from that pitas, also vibration is coming. Yeah. So, what we are going to, we are trying to open from pitas, those root will come out. From root, another root will come out. Yeah. That's how it works. So. By tying Kundalini, what we are doing, Kundalini itself is the nourish power. It's must. Any tree, if you sow seed, you will make sure there is fertilizer and water. Only must and place will the any plant will grow very healthy and nicely. But if of this uh, earth, imagine this is the earth. It's not must, then there is no seed. No seed will grow. So by putting oil and everything, you are making soften this on physical level. You are nourishing this. No, this has nothing to do with kundalini. You are nourishing this part of your head, so it comes soft. That skin comes soft, and through the skin, those pitas is in this sandwich. Half away, in is placed. So it's not placed on the upper part. It's right in the between. So by softening this, the uh, vibration can penetrate because vibration comes in the force, like a pipe. <coughs> if you have a water pipe and the water coming in force, and if you press your with your thumb, it goes other way. So exactly that comes here. So if some points are close, it will go on other side. Other side. That's how it penetrates in, and that is the nurturing of your spirit. Who is? What is your spirit? Your attention. When there's a dead body, what is missing? Spirit. spirit. And we call it's a dead body. And when that spirit is in the body, the, and now dead body does not have attention. So attention is the spirit. To nurture spirit, you have to bring here, because your kundalini will bring the attention here. She is nurturing. She is the ground. Parachetanya's energy is coming, and he is nurturing. He is purifying that chitta. The purifying of the chitta happens here, but you can nurture your chakra by putting your right hand, left hand towards Mataji. That's how we nurture this chakra. But for sastra nurturing. Param Chaitanya energy. That's why fourth point mm. and come down and you feel better. And read good books. Devi Bhagavatam. Uh, Durga Saptashati. Why we have to do? Uh, once there was a program in Porchester Hall, mm. Sri Mataji's public program. And we went there. So we were a little behind. And after program, she, everybody was going to Sri Mataji and meet her. So I went there and Sri Mataji, oh, you came. And she hold my hand. And she told me, Argla Stotra is my favorite Stotra. And then she said, you must do And do the Sahaja Yoga, go in deep. Always you will benefit. There is no loss. This thing, and then she started talking to someone. And these heads started thinking, in Porchester Hall, mm. all these people are here. Why she's mentioning me that Arbla Stotra is her favorite 